the president in a ruling on thursday kenya's supreme court has declared controversial constitutional changes proposed by president uhuru kenyatta as illegal following the 2017 election that almost split the country kenyatta and opposition leader reila odinga agreed on a plan called the building bridges initiative which would introduce the permanent office of prime minister and increase the number of parliamentary seats from 290 to 360. However, the Supreme Court ruled unanimously against this idea, stating that the president cannot initiate constitutional amendment or changes through popular initiative under Article 257 of the Constitution. The president cannot initiate constitutional amendments or changes through the popular initiative under Article 257 of the Constitution. The ruling was given by a seven-judge bench at the Supreme Court, headed by Martha Kume, the country's first female chief justice. Major critics of the constitutional amendment, including William Ruto, who is also a deputy to President Kenyatta, say it is a little more than a naked grab for power by a two-term president who cannot run a third time. The president, however, argued that the initiative would make politics more inclusive and help end repeated cycles of election violence in the East African nation. The timing of the amendment has fueled rumors in recent years that Kenyatta is attempting to maintain power by including a prime ministerial role in the BBI.